Hi everyone, today we're going to do a baseline noise comparison between three oscilloscopes. The Teledyne LaCroix WaveSurfer 4000 HD 12-bit high definition oscilloscope, the Roden Schwartz RTA 4000 series, which is advertised as using a 10-bit ADC, and the Keysight 4000X, which is an 8-bit oscilloscope. You would expect the Teledyne LaCroix 12-bit oscilloscope to be the best performer. You would also expect the Roden Schwartz 10-bit ADC oscilloscope to perform better than the 8-bit oscilloscope from Keysight, right? First, we have a 200 MHz Teledyne LaCroix WaveSurfer 4024 HD set to 100 mV per division. You can see that the baseline noise is about 250 microvolts. This is 12-bit performance. Second, we have the same setup on a 200 MHz Roden Schwartz RTA4004. You can see that the noise is significantly worse. The RTA4004 has over 10 times more noise despite being advertised as using a 10-bit ADC. Third, let us look at the Keysight MSOX4104A, an 8-bit oscilloscope to use for a comparison. You would expect it to be a lot noisier than the Roden Schwartz, right? But it is not. The noise readout here is about 2 millivolts. It has 5 times the bandwidth and lower noise than the Roden Schwartz 200 MHz oscilloscope. Clearly, the Roden Schwartz does not have the advertised class leading signal integrity and noise or a four fold improvement over conventional 8-bit A to D converters. We've clearly demonstrated that the Teledyne LaCroix oscilloscope has far less baseline noise. On average, across all gain settings, Roden Schwartz has five times more noise than Teledyne LaCroix. You have to ask, why does an 8-bit oscilloscope outperform the Roden Schwartz 10-bit ADC oscilloscope? To learn more about the WaveSurfer 4000 HD, Log on to teledynelacroix.com slash WS4000HD.